All right, Mr. Moving on here. Continue our documentary on at our undisclosed location for this porch. They had a couple days of bad weather, so there was a stall on it. They still have yet to cut their windows out, but they did get tar paper up around it to protect the wood. And they did get the roof completely finished. I don't think you can tell and see the flashing or that anything up there, but it is complete. They are now going to work on running their wiring and their insulation. So when they get around to that, or get that part going, or all right, we're back at our undisclosed location. Um, as you can tell, they got wiring going. They're going to wait till they get their walls up to fix their boxes and they've already started the insulation in the ceiling and getting ready to finish the insulation on the walls so it'll take, probably take them a couple hours to get it all cut and stapled in they're still leaving the windows covered until they get their glass fixed that will be coming out and patched over and once they get the insulation in it will start putting their ceiling up, which is this wood right here. Hello everyone. Back on the next step. They have got their ceiling completed. As far as get, getting all of it up, they are going to take cut strippings, go over all these seams. And now they have already started their drywall. They got their first piece up right there. And already cut the outlet out for it. That way they didn't forget where it was at. So, they have eight and seven more of them to go. Two windows to cut out. An air conditioner to move. Then they'll worry about the floor when they get to it, I reckon. So, alright, we're back. We've got all the drywall up. And as you can tell, they just started doing the drywall, the mud, plaster, whatever you want to call it. Uh, they started here around this window. All the drywall is up. Don't look too bad. If you can see past the light, the dark, here we go. All the receptacles and switches are in. They have their ceiling trim up over the seams. down here on the end just happen to be right at the end there's the center all right get the plaster done get a ceiling light hooked up next step we'll be pulling the, the AC and getting it cleaned out of here ready for the floor maybe start on the windows all right everyone mr. moving on here uh, the next day after a drywall and spackle, uh, they've already put a second coat on all the way around. And here at their windows, you can see right here, they've drilled out their holes for their corners of their windows. So what they've done then is they've cleaned up a little bit, straightened it up a little bit. And out here, their windows had to have some glass replaced in it. And here's a piece of that right here. And the way they done it is they taped off where they were going to cut it. And then used a good old saber saw here. Fine tooth blade on low speed. Got that took care of. And here on the outside, you can see they taped it off. As long as they stay on the inside of them holes, they'll be doing good. Or the inside of the tape. Here are their windows. Got the glass back in them and got them glazed. They're setting up. 
why they work on getting these windows cut out. There's the other end. Alright. So they'll get them cut out, get the windows set, and probably move on to their next part of the project. See, they got some more lumber laying here. I believe they're going to put a ramp in here. But, who knows. Alright, they got their windows in, started trim work, made their own trim, got it ready, already trimmed around the door. There it is. This is some good old 2 by 4 split down to size. They got it sealed around there, windows before they uh, put the trim up. And walls are ready for sanding, the floor is ready for cleaning. They got that AC out of the hole, out of the wall there, got it covered over. It, they are calling it a day, so I guess tomorrow's another day. Catch you then, and we'll make our mistakes. <laughs>